Hi, Dave Anderson here at The Camera Company. Today I'm going to show you how to set both a black and a white point using Lightroom's tools. It's very important that your photos have a black and white point set. That way you get a good tonal range across the entire spectrum. So let's get started. Okay, so here I am in the develop module of Lightroom and I've selected a photo to work on. And what we want to do is set both the black and the white point. As we can look at our image, there are areas which are going to be totally black with no detail and there should be areas that are totally white with no detail in them. If we set those points correctly, what will happen is that our print will look good and our image will look really good. So the easiest way to do this is to, in the basic development tools, we have white and blacks. If you hold down the option key while you move the white slider back and forth, you'll see how you get start to, it creates a mask, and those areas that you see come up are going to be areas that are going to be pure white. So we let that off the option key and off of the slider, and you can see that, that we have now selected those areas to be white. So let's look at that again. Those areas are going to be white. We do the same with a black. Hold down the Alt Option key and then slide the slider until the blacks start to show. Our mask comes up and it shows us just the areas that are going to be pure black. Let's compare what it looks like before and after now. And you can see the before and after how my whites have gotten whiter, my blacks have stayed black, and my image has a nice tonal range going across the full spectrum. We could also use that on this picture of the leaves. It looks just kind of flat right now. So I'm going to leave the before and after up side by side. I'm going to hold down the Alt Option key. I'm going to move the white slider until we see some highlights coming in there. Now we've got some highlights. I'm going to move, hold down the Option uh, Alt key and move my black slider until I get some shadow detail coming in there. And now we can look at the before and after. You can see how we've given that picture some life. And one last one, and I'm going to zoom in a little bit here. We have a border collie laying out in the field. And on the border collie, we want the whites and the blacks to be set properly so that we get a good look across the, the whole spectrum. So I'm holding down the Alt Option key. We're going to move that white slider again until we get just a little bit of white peeking through there. I'm going to hold down the Alt Option key and move the black slider. And as you can see from the left to the right image, how we have improved the tonal and contrast range of this image. So again, you might want, not want to do this to every image, but if you want to set a black and white point easy in Lightroom, the Alt Option key plus the sliders for both white and black will do that for you. Okay, that's how you set the black and white point in Lightroom. Practice this, add it to your workflow, and we hope this tip was useful. If so, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow us on Facebook, and we'll see you on the next tip.